Hello guys! Good day! So for today's video, ay magkakaroon na naman tayo ng tutorial. And this tutorial is about the solenoid valve. So this solenoid valve is very important and very useful no? when it comes to pneumatic and hydraulic system. So itong solenoid valve guys, is just like a contactor or a relay na once na na-energize, okay, all normally open contacts would be closed and all normally closed contact would be open. So that, the current can pass through the circuit. So, same here with the solenoid valve. So, once na energize ang solenoid or yung coil, yung normally closed valve will be open and permits the flow of the fluid, no? either hydraulic coil or compressed air. It is just like a faucet na kapag kailangan mo ng tubig, so ang gagawin natin is i-open natin yung valve, no? i-open natin yung valve manually uh, by rotating it or twisting it in a counterclockwise. Or kung gusto mo naman i-close yung faucet or yung valve, so ang ginagawa natin is i-rotate natin siya or tinitwist natin siya in a clockwise rotation. So dito naman sa solenoid valve, Alright, so let's say uh, it is in normally closed valve. So, for you to open the valve, okay, so we have to energize the solenoid or coil. So, meaning to say, uh, we will press the push button switch to energize the coil. Diba? So, we do not need to use our hands to open it, no? So, just like sa faucet natin na nirotate pa natin siya in a clockwise rotation or in a counterclockwise rotation para ma-close or para ma-open yung valve. Pero dito sa solenoid valve, hindi na natin kailangan. Uh, all we need is the push button switch or any switches okay, to energize the solenoid or coil. Okay? So, kung gusto mo matutunan ang mga ganitong bagay-bagay, ay huwag mong kalimutan i-hit ang subscribe button at i the notification bell so that you will be notified when I have new uploads. Alright? So without any further ado, let's start! Okay, energizing solenoid C. So dapat umilaw yan guys, no? Try natin. Ayan. Then also the top. Ayan. And also the solenoid A. Okay. Okay guys. So tignan natin guys. No? And kung nakikita nyo guys. No? Yung indicator natin. Na pang dispense cylinder. May ilaw no? So ngayon ang gagawin natin, itong ating cylinder, no? Ay uh, uh, i natin using the air. So pneumatic tayo, guys, no? Okay? And then we will test the solenoid valve if it is still working or not, no? Okay, so let's try the let's try the first uh, uh, first cylinder, okay? So by using the air. Okay, so ilagay natin siya sa boss. Ayan, so meron na tayong air guys na lumadali dito, no? And then, so ang gagawin lang natin guys, i-energize natin yung coil or yung solenoid valve na para dito, para mag-open and then, magkaroon dito ng air. Okay, so try natin. Ito ay. Ayan. So ito guys, so kung titignan nyo guys, no? Itong ating cylinder, no? So itong cylinder nito is for the eject cylinder. That is the solenoid C. Okay. Energies natin ng solenoid C. Okay. So, bumukas ang ating solenoid. Bumukas ang valve. So, pumasok ang air. So, tinulak ni itong ating uh, itong ating piston. Okay. Okay. So, de-energies ko yan. Wawala. Wawala yung air. Ayan. Kasi is pang return. Okay. Next. The other one. Nasaan ba yung isa? Ito. So, I think this is for the solenoid A. So, energies natin ng solenoid A. Okay. Ayan guys. So na-energize ng solenoid A. So ibig sabihin, nag-open yung valve. 
then the air pumasok ayan so di ka nagkais ko kasi free return siya okay so ganyan lang sa guys no okay okay na good Ayun. Yun. Mm. May distant mm. kasi yan eh. Kasi pang ano talaga yan? Pang malita lang na distant. Isos, pag dumagad yung gilimang sa...